Hi everyone, it's PhD Simmer here and welcome back to Pleasant View and we're playing with the Dreamer household. Uh, as I started, as I loaded up the lot, Darlene has the wants to get married and have a baby. So we're get, definitely going to have them try for a baby. Dirk wants to earn some money, so I've got him the money tree because he's got the points to be able to do that, which is awesome. And this is a good way of just fulfilling that want for the teens. I'm just having Darren quickly look for a job. Oh, the medicine career is here today. That's awesome. He can actually get a job, which is great. He actually rolled a bazillion career ones. Look, any job. He's like, I'll take any job. I've got to support my family. Though, to be honest, his um, painting is doing really well. Okay, so Dirk, do you want to get yourself a something to eat? Why so up and about at this time in the morning? Darlene's waiting patiently on the bed and he's going to take that job. You never know, he might he want, might want to quit. They both want to hire a maid as well, both Darlene and Darren. So I might have Dustin come and do that. But yeah, we're going to have try for a baby. I really, really hope they have a kid. That'll be so fun. But they never expected to be able to have another child together. We're going to make out and then try for baby. I'm going to get rid of this light. And I need to renovate this lot a little bit. But for now, we'll just put some better lights in, I think. Dirk's room doesn't even have a light. Well, he's got a lamp. That's a bit better. So they're going to try for a baby. And also, we'll have a wedding. That'll be exciting. I don't have a wedding venue yet, so we'll do a house ven uh, house wedding. Or we could do like the park or something, but it doesn't have an arch or anything there. So we'll probably just do a house wedding for now. But I think what I want to do is when my tax money is back up, because I spent quite a lot of money on Doc Allen's a retirement home and interactive, when I've got my tax money back up, in, uh, the next thing I'm going to do is build a wedding venue or a church or like a town hall that people can get married in, something like that I'm thinking of. Right, we're going to call a maid. That's what they want to do. I don't know if they're going to go back to sleep now because they're not that tired. But they've tried for a baby and now they want pets. So a dog or a cat. Dirk doesn't want one particularly. Um, He wants to talk. Can we chat online? I don't know if that would count. Probably not. Okay, they have gone back to sleep. Let's get Darren. Well, let, we'll let them sleep for a little bit since it is the middle of the night. Oh, Lucy's online. Let's talk to her. Oh, how do you... Why can't we talk to her? Also, I want him to bank online. Um, He has... 851 saved up so we're going to deposit 800 for him just so he can start earning a little bit of interest oh he has more money in his bank account is that your outerwear dirk um i'm not a big fan of that but he's gonna be age up in a couple of rounds so it's not the biggest deal let's have him go to loo i'm just trying to keep him happy because he woke up so early this morning um why don't you just go and chat Oh, he earned 1,500 quid because he got some money in his bank account. And that's awesome. Oh, he wants to talk to Lilith and dance with Lilith. Um, it's probably a bit too early to call her. Why don't you serve some breakfast, get some cooking skill going. Serve some toast pastries. Please don't burn the house down. We do have a fire alarm, so it's not too bad. Darren's cuddling in bed with Darlene this morning. How sweet. They're both hungry, but they can eat when Dirk's cooked. And then we'll lock in the want to talk to Lilith. He could do that after school, probably. Or he might ring her before school. Okay, Darren, come and eat. We should get another chair now. Now that we've got um, Darlene back in the family, we could have three chairs. And he's going to call a sim. Hopefully he can speak to her before school and she's not too mad. Oh, and Darren started his job, which is exciting for him. He needs logic and cleaning. He wants to get level four of cleaning, so that's really handy. I don't think he's going to get a chance to ring Lilith. I think the school bus is going to be there too song. Oh, he's just so in love with Darlene. All the wants for her. It's a shame about Brandy that that didn't end well. Pretty toxic. I'm going to have Dirk harvest the money tree as well. Oh, sorry, I interrupted your breakfast. Just because the maid's going to get here um, and we don't want her to steal the money. Well, I'll keep track of the money tree stuff and he can add that to his savings. He's harvested it once before. It's like another 40 quid for him, so why not? Um, should we have Darlene take a pregnancy test? Ah, oh, I really hope she's pregnant. Since they tried for a baby last night, she's going to take the pregnancy test early. I'm going to have Darren study for cleaning. Okay. Come on, Darlene, let's take this pregnancy test. Please, please. No, she's not pregnant. Oh, and she's sad about it. Don't worry, we can try again. We will try again. I'm just looking at Darren's work schedule. So we could have the wedding on Thursday, I think. Oh, she's got to work nine till four. He's got to work seven till two. Basically, the only time they can get married is today because they're both off. If we want to marry them this round. Yeah, I think we're going to have to get married. <laughs> Darren, sorry, can I interrupt your cleaning? Because you need to come and try for a baby. I think we'll have the wedding after 
Dirk gets home from school. It, it won't be anything too fancy. They've got married before. They don't have that much fun, so it'll be a, a nice little family occasion. Maybe a few close friends. Oh, Darlene wants to be friends with Caitlin. That's okay. You don't really know anyone, apart from Mortimer. So we can talk to Caitlin. Okay, Darren, I want you to carry on studying your cleaning skill when you're done. Thank you. Oh, I hope she gets pregnant from this. That's cool, cool, Kaylin. Maybe if we have a friend, we can invite her to the wedding. <laughs> she's friends with Mortimer, but she's quite a lot younger than Darren. Um, he's actually going to be... Look, hold on, let me speak to Kaylin. He's Oh, he's got quite a while to become an elder, but she is significantly younger because obviously she's died and gone back to whatever age she was. Maybe I should edit her age. Let me know what you guys think. Come on, Darren, let's get this cleaning skill. I think I also want to get Darlene a new outfit. So I'm going to have her shop online and buy some everyday wear. Also, her pyjamas aren't very good. A bit old-fashioned, so we'll do that. PJs. Dirk is horsing around with some classmates one afternoon when he manages to effortlessly toss a chair clear across the classroom. The football coach notices this display of skill and promptly gives Dirk a spot on the team. Within days, Dirk becomes a star player and takes home £150 for Player of the Year award. Wow, Dirk! That's awesome. He's got over £2,000 saved up now. That is so good. I think this outfit could be quite cute for Darlene and it's kind of the top is similar to what she had before. So I'm going to pick that for her. And then just for her nighty, we'll just change it to something a little bit, just a bit more, I don't know, her ass one was pretty old fashioned. Maybe just these cute little pyjamas. Do them in white. Cool. And then let's plan her everyday outfit and see if we like it. Oh, we have a visitor. Yay, Angela, let's greet her and make sure you harvest your money tree before she nicks it. Oh, he learned cleaning skill. Perfect. Come and eat your food and then take a shower. Yeah, Dirt's grades are slipping. We have to worry about that. I think that looks quite cute for Darlene. Let's go for it. It's nice of Angela to visit. Let's admire her, gossip with her, see what she's got to say. Maybe Lilith will get upset. But he does want to talk to Lilith, so we will... No, don't tell a day joke to her. Are you about to eat Darren's sub sandwich? Yeah, I think this is cute. I like this look on her. I'm not sure about the shoes. They're a bit red, but I like I like the, the outfit. Right, I'm going to have her take a pregnancy test because they're actively trying for a baby. I think taking a pregnancy test makes sense. These two have a little gossip. Hmm. <gasps> Darlene's pregnant. Yay. Oh my God, there's a new baby coming. That's so exciting. You better get, get some food. Oh, he's talking with Lilith. He wants to buy a computer game. Okay. Uh, can we buy those online? um buy video games let's try it they're talking about being engaged that's so sweet oh yeah we need to get married crap um we're just gonna have a very simple wedding ceremony a cake and a can you even get a wedding cake sure you can we're just gonna have an arch <laughs> we can't afford much okay here's a wedding cake we can place it oh where are we gonna put it i guess we'll just put it on the counter this is gonna be a sad wedding we can't even afford a nice arch. We're going to have to go with this arch, which is not like horrendous, but is it a wedding arch? Yeah. Actually, we can afford this one, which is really cute. Yes, yeah, so let's get married by the barbecue in the garden. Okay, right. Let's throw a wedding party. So let's have Darlene. She's pretty tired, though. That's that's the sad thing. Right, we'll buy him a game. Throw a wedding party. Dirk's also pretty tired. Um. Okay, who are we going to invite? Let's see. Mortimer, Kaylin. I don't think we have that many other friends of the family. Can we invite Lilith? Yes. Should we invite the parents of... Yeah, we invite our, our son's girlfriend's parents. That seems random, but we'll do that. <laughs> we should have invited um, oh, Dina. That's a bit mean to not invite Mortimer's wife, but we'll see. Okay. So should we get some... No, because there'll be, there'll be music. Let's get... Ooh, what are we even going to do about chairs? We're going to have to take the dining chairs outside and get a couple more. Um, I'm not even sure that's going to be enough, but... Is anyone coming? I'm not sure people are coming to the party. <laughs> How sad. Okay, let's put these chairs outside as well. Why is that object in use? Has the party started? Oh, here we go. Yay, people actually did turn up. That's nice. I think I'm going to have Dirk say goodbye to Angela just because they're going to cause trouble otherwise. Oh, that chair's still saying it's in use. How annoying. Cool, guests have arrived. Oh, Mary Sue, you look so nice in that dress. Let's come and admire her, chat to her. Darlene, why don't you talk to Daniel, do a school cheer, and then talk to Kaylin. What's Mortimer doing? Congratulating. Oh, nice. And Dirk, you talk to Lilith. Let's charm her and give her a romantic hug and make out with her. Hopefully, this will keep the party going. Oh, no, these two aren't getting on. Oh, 
Can I tell you a joke, Mary Sue? Okay, maybe I did Mary Sue's blush a little bit too harsh. Can I tell you a joke? Okay, let's get the answer this phone. Look at these two make it out. They're not interested in the wedding. Oh, this didn't... Oh, he wants to play a computer game. I thought he wanted to buy a computer game. Okay, people were not getting on with their wedding guests. That's pretty bad. Okay, answer the phone then. Where are you guys going? Okay, good. You're going to dance. That's fine. Can we answer the phone, please? My gosh. There we go. Right, Darlene is hungry. Why don't you just finish this half-eaten sandwich off? And then we're going to have the wedding very soon. Once Dirk's had a shower, basically. <laughs> Where did Lilith go? Oh, they're all just having a boogie upstairs. <laughs> Look at Mary Sue going. What is this dance, guys? Okay, stop talking. Let's go and get married. Dirk, you better hurry up. There he is. Cool. Who's this random? Jeffrey, did I invite you? Oh, I don't even know what Darlene's formal wear is. Oh, gosh. Um, I wouldn't have picked it, but... Mm, not ideal. Damn it, I should have bought her a formal dress. I think Bella also has that as her formal dress. Uh, guys? Oh, crap. Did I put the... <laughs> I put the, wrong, the chairs the wrong side. Oh, there's a hill. How are you supposed to sit in a hill? Okay, we can sit like this, surely. There you go. There's a few seats for the elderly. <laughs> Mortimer gets a seat as a priority. Jeffrey, I'm not sure who you are. You are. Yeah, boy, dear. But at least they're gonna get married. How cute. Oh, how cute. Um, I think they're the same, right? But I'll just say other other sim just in case. And it's so far it's not bad. Oh, how cute. Good darling. So in love. Uh what's <laughs> what's happened to your eyes, darling? Are you okay? Um, that was weird. Oh gosh. Well, they got married. How nice. Okay, cool. Um, Dirk, why don't you go? Half the guests just decided to boogie upstairs and not actually attend the wedding. So that's great. Let's come and hit on Lilith. Give her a goose. Maybe not in front of her dad and smooch. Darlene, she has to go to bed because she is tired. Oh no. What happened? What's happened? Oh, I forgot. Did I forget again Kaylin was here? Oh, wow. Okay, let me just I keep forgetting that Kaylin is the one who's probably got the presence marriage and I keep inviting her to set the same gatherings. I'm terrible, I'm terrible. Let's have a look at his memories. I think it's all just the same drama repeating itself. Oh my gosh. Maybe we should come and say goodbye to Kaylin just before we go to bed. Say goodbye to Kaylin because this is just bad. Okay, and Darlene can go to bed. And Darren, I need you to smooth the wedding guest. Try and talk to Daniel a little bit. I know he's really mad, but <laughs> Mary Sue's like, no, Daniel, I don't want anything. I don't want to talk to you today. We're at a wedding. Let's not cause a scene. She's like, where's the music at? Let's turn it back on. <laughs> Mortimer's on the bog. <laughs> Lilith wants to be on there. She looks cute in her little party dress, though. I like this one on her. It's a roof raiser so far. I don't know how. Darlene's just gone to bed. <laughs> These two are chatting in the bathroom. They seem to be getting on all right. Maybe it's all the romantic interactions with Lilith. Poor old Darlene. But we should have the baby... Ooh, let's get some more money from the money tree. Should have the baby relatively soon. <laughs> She's just like, let me, don't mind me, kids. I'm just going to sit here and eat my crisps. <laughs> you two make out. Me and your father were like that one day, Lilith. Young's love dreams. Now he's trampled all over my heart. <laughs> okay, I think... Dirk's also going to have to go to bed, which is pretty tragic. But Daniel is just going to have to be the the smoother. He doesn't really get on with Mary Sue. Let's try Mortimer. Admire him. Chat with him. Talk about cuisine. Everyone likes food. Everyone's gone to bed. Daniel, uh, Darren's just hosting the whole party. I love it. At least they got married, though. It wasn't like the most exciting ceremony in the world, but we did it. Oh, no. You're not getting on with Mortimer? Damn it. Can we just chat, Mortimer? Let me impart my creativity knowledge onto you. I think we're going to have a roof raiser, though. Unless it drops down at the final minute because we're getting some negative interactions with Mortimer. I think we did it. Yay, a roof raiser. That's awesome. He does not like Mary Sue, though. I don't know why, but doesn't get on with her. <laughs> okay. Oh, we didn't cut the wedding cake. Oh, that's sad. <laughs> oh, well, they had a good party. Uh, Mary Sue, are you just going home naked or are you going to get dressed? <laughs> I love it. Daniel's just like, honey, put some clothes on. She's like, nope, not gonna. Gonna walk home in in the buff. Look at my pixelated booty. Oh, dear. Where are we gonna put a nursery? I think we'll just turn this into a room. I'm gonna get rid of this sofa. Let me just have a little tidy up up here. 
We get a nicer bookcase as well. Okay, I've got them a bookcase downstairs and I made this into a bedroom. Let me just paint the remaining walls. That will be the nursery, I think. And let's just sell the wedding stuff, get our money back. Also, our dining room chairs would be good. So these guys haven't qualified for a welfare payment this round because they have jobs now. So they've got their own income source. But they will get some money towards the birth of the child for baby supplies because their household funds are very low. Okay, Darlene just got her first baby bum, which is very exciting. She's now on maternity leave. She's got to clean up the wedding cake because they didn't actually cut it, which is pretty sad. Where are these flies coming from? Was that the wedding cake? Oh no, I hope not. It's pretty gross. They didn't even eat the wedding cake. How sad. I've left this bush here as well for um, Dirk to harvest in the morning. She's just going to watch. Oh, you broke the TV. I don't think you should try and fix that. Um, have you got any skill? <laughs> You're going to get yourself electrocuted. Have a look. Uh, she's got... Um, I mean, it would help her get mechanical skill. Let's try not to kill her while she's pregnant. Can they get killed, pregnant sims? Oh, please don't get electrocuted. Oh, she's nearly done it. Yay! No, don't work out. Watch it. <laughs> okay, Darren's got to go to work in an hour. Crap. Oh, gosh. Okay. I'm going to eat, dude. Take a shower. He wants to sell a masterpiece, so we'll lock that in. Can't believe he's got to go to work so early. I'm actually going to move the bookcase because it's a bit tall there. It's in front of the toilet, which makes it... Less easy for me. Oh my god, look at that toilet. That is disgusting. I know we hired a maid, guys, but it doesn't mean this is acceptable to leave this like this. That is grim. Okay, he's got to go to work. Dirk's awake. He can harvest the money tree to get some money. Darlene, you're going to have to go back to bed, sweet. Dirk, I'm sorry, dude. You're going to have to use the gross toilet. <laughs> I don't know how to get him to win a gaming competition. Hmm. Well... Also, let's have a quick check of his tax money so he can add some more to his bank's his uh, savings so he can add a bit more to his bank account. He should have 2,150. Bank online, check money. Oh, he's got 1,900. Okay. So let's put another 100 in for him. I'm sorry you've got to use the dirty toilet. It's so grim. His environment score went so low when he went in that bathroom. I'm not surprised. Okay, 2,000 pounds. That's really good. Let's harvest some more simoleons. Let's book him a driving lesson as well. Um, no, we can't do 11. I need after school hours, please. 8 p.m. Yep, it's quite late to go for a driving lesson, but sure. Darlene has woken after having a little bit of a nap. I'm going to get her to have um some pasta for lunch. She's got her first little baby bump. So we're definitely going to see the baby born before the end of this round. She wants to play video games, flirt with Darren, play a computer game, play Marco Polo. Okay. Nothing too interesting going on there other than the maid is just like absolute filth. I can't believe these people. I was only here yesterday. Oh crap, have we got no food? Okay, let me order some groceries. Yes, Darlene, help by picking up one plate. You should have should have touched the toilet. Uh, let's get some groceries. And we also have a hundred pound bill to pay. Oh, that's quite a lot of money. But at least we were two how two household income. No, that's not what I was trying to say. A two income household. <laughs> Thank you for delivering my food. We now have £23. That's pretty tragic. <gasps> oh, crap. I forgot we didn't have enough money to pay the maid. Oh, no. Whoopsie. She stole a chair. I mean, <gasps> don't take anything else. Don't take anything else. A chair is enough, right? <laughs> I'm sorry. Oh, my gosh. Well, we started off as a two-person household, a two-chair household, and now we're a two-chair household once again. Oh, my God. Dirk could lose his part-time job if he doesn't keep up with high school. Uh-oh. How's he doing? A D plus. But it is Tuesday, so we will get to do a coin flip for him. So let me just get that open on my phone. And luckily for him, he got heads. So you are going straight to doing your homework, mister. No stopping. You can be upset about the chair later. Look at that stack. Oh, really? Can you not do it? We need to put something on this desk so that he won't put his homework there. So we'll put the lamp there. We'll just let him do his homework until he basically gets bored or his needs get too low. Darlene. Oh... Are you okay? Yeah, I know the chair being stolen is upsetting. I'm sorry. Okay, Darren's home from work, so we've got a little bit of extra money. I'm going to have him carry on painting so we can try and sell that painting for money as well. Until Dirk indicates to me he doesn't want to do his homework, I will just let him carry on. But his fun's getting pretty low, so I think he's stopped naturally soon. No. So, okay, that's the end of him doing his homework, so he will have to coin flip or roll again, which I think is a decent enough method, especially when we got so many stacks. I'm going to have let him play on the computer. But he should go up mm, he should be out of deed territory okay darren you're painting well done you oh 600 quid we needed that let's have you serve some dinner let's have let's have spaghetti so does dirk have work today no he's back to work tomorrow 
But he does have his driver on test later, so we'll get, try and get his fun levels up. And darling, he's just chilling. Who's this? Oh, it's probably about arting, arting, artists. <laughs> You're hungry. Well, we wait for Darren to serve some food. Well done. Your enthusiasm knows no bounds. I've placed a special plaque in your inventory as a gift for your hobby devotion. Oh, she's already got that. Do they get that every time that they, do they get that every time they re-maximise it? Oh, <gasps> he wants to quit his job. He did one day and was like, nah, this is not for me. <laughs> Go for it, Darren. He worked one day in his whole life towards his lifetime wish. <laughs> and he just went, nah, don't fancy it anymore. You move these homeworks over here. I love that. He's like, I I've got confidence now. I could be an artist and support my family. Right, let's serve spaghetti then. Try and get Dirk's fun up before he goes on his driving lesson. That's looking a little better. Darling, come and get some fresh spaghetti. She's going to have to go to bed soon. She's, uh... oh, oh, are we having it? Or is it baby bump number two? No, it's baby bump number two. Oh my God. We're so soon. So soon. I'm really pleased for Darren. Now he wants to get a job in architecture, but no, I'm not gonna. He's just gonna work as a freelance artist at home, just selling his paintings. I think that's what I'm gonna get him to do. He'll never fulfill his lifetime wish, but that's fine. Right, let's get you to harvest your simoleons. And then your driving lesson's here. I'm gonna save just before he goes, just in case something goes wrong. Good luck. Hope it goes well. Do you want to answer the phone, babe? Let's do it. Oh, is she talking to Dina? I hope you're not going to start flirting. Let's just paint. Get another painting going. But it'll be good because um, Darlene's going to be going back to work. So it'll be nice for him to look after the baby. and They don't have to pay for a nanny. He's not going to be able to paint for long because he needs to go back to sleep. But Dirk should home about 10. Oh, it takes a little bit longer just to come home as well. But that's good. He's returned from his driving lesson. I can't remember how many he took. But let's book in another one. Um, yes, because he can get that 3 p.m. He could just get that done in, before work. And hopefully he'll get out of D territory, which would be nice. Darren's really tired, so I'm going to have him go to bed. He can work on the painting tomorrow and I'll whiz through the night unless the baby's born. Oh, and Dirk got another £100 interest on his bank account. So that's awesome. He wants to go to work. We'll lock that in and he wants to earn some money, which is OK, because the money tree will come through soon, I think. OK, let's harvest the money tree. What are you doing? Don't play that. Harvest the money tree. Get that want fulfilled. Oh, no, 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 no. Go on the school bus in a minute. Get the money. There we go. Fulfill that want. <laughs> he just keeps wanting to win a gaming competition, which is so bizarre. Okay, Darlene, you're not in looking in good shape, sweet. Let's get you to bed. She should hopefully have the baby any time soon. Oh, he's painting the creepy clown. clown. Oh, I can't speak today. He's painting the creepy clown picture. <laughs> That's what I'm trying to say. Oh, oh, the baby's coming, the baby's coming. Oh my gosh, this is so exciting. Hey, it's a single baby. I do not like t twins, it scares me. <laughs> oh, stop. Oh, brand new baby. How cute. Uh, it's a baby boy. I think we should stick with the D names for this family. And um, we're going to call him... I'm going to call him Dylan. Dylan Dreamer. How cute. Oh, he wants to study parenting. He wants to buy everything. Let's give them their thousand pounds, though. Okay, so they've got the money they need. And let's buy the baby supplies. Again, this is not going to be the most exciting baby room because we don't have a lot of money. Let's have a little look at Dylan. I think I saw blue eyes. Oh, how cute. Hello, little man. Yeah, blue eyes, which Darlene definitely has blue eyes. Um, So I think he gets them from her, but I don't know about Darren. Oh, we'll get the bottle fridge as well. I always forget that one. But it's handy to have it upstairs. And let's just save again now that we've had the baby. Poor lot, Darlene. Her fun levels are so low. Um, She likes arts and crafts as well. So can they afford a second easel? So it'd be nice if she could do that for fun. Oh, he's doing terribly in school, but he did loads of homework. What the hell? How's that fair? He did loads of homework. Do they have to do all of it? Is that what they have to do? Maybe I should make him do all of it then. I just assumed if they did some, it would help. Okay, he's got to go on his driving lesson. Hurry up, you're going to be late. Oh, he's watching her. That's so cute, but she... Actually, that got her fun up a lot. He needs to go to sleep, though. She needs to go to sleep. Darren, don't criticise her painting, please. That would be very rude. I think he said something nice to her. We need to look after the baby. So let's come and hold Dylan. How cute. I'll give you a bottle. It's his first time holding his son. Oh, little baby dreamer. Look at him. He looks so proud. 
Oh, he has got blue eyes as well. They both got blue eyes. He looks like a proud dad, though, for sure. Okay, Dirk's back from his driving lesson, which is awesome. He's going to have to go to work soon, so let's get him to use the bathroom, take a shower. I'm hoping he can finish the last piece of homework. Yeah, Dirk's got to go work in an hour. Hopefully he's going to be okay. He's probably not going to have time to eat. Darren, put the baby back in the crib, please. And hopefully he can finish another painting. Oh, she's proper loving it up on her husband. That's so cute. Though, she does want skills for work. Does she want a mechanical? Cooking? Charisma? No, she doesn't want a mechanical, which is unfortunate. But she does want to buy a baby toy. Okay, Dirk, better head to work. Are we, are we arguing? Maybe we should say goodbye to her. Okay, Darlene, can you come and change Dylan's nappy, please? It's pretty stinkums. He's a stinky baby. Come on, let's hold him. Let's wake him up. I know. Time for a change. Aww, how cute. We're gonna serve some dinner. We're gonna serve beef stroganoff. Hopefully we sell this painting for a lot. I like this little uh, whale wallpaper. That's so cute. Uh, he gave up. He's too tired. But hopefully dinner will be ready when you've had your shower. Mmm, mac and cheese. No, what was it? Beef beef stew? I can't remember. Oh, no. Oh, dear. Darren, no. You've got to eat your wife's burnt food. Sorry. <laughs> She'll get offended otherwise. Right, what time does Dirk finish? Oh, he wants to buy a bookcase costing at least 650 Um, no. <laughs> He should have around 2,400 in his bank account, so we'll check that when we get home. Oh, he's got 2,100. Oh, he'll get his wages from today as well. Okay, cool. Let's have him bank um, some money. And he wants to play a computer game, but I think he probably needs to sleep because he's got school tomorrow. Actually, can you book another driving lesson in as well? And everyone else is nice and asleep. Right, it's Thursday morning. Hopefully Dirk is going to actually go up in his grade this morning. That'd be nice. I'm going to get him to play on the computer because that's what he wants to do. Darlene is cuddling up with Darren. That is so cute. Get her up. Does she have work today? Um, She does. I wish she would get a mechanical skill point. Maybe if we let her get another skill, she'll roll something. Oh, she's rolling new ones. Oh, she wants to get a promotion and she wants to get creativity level three. Um, Okay. And she wants to become friends with Cassandra. We can do that, I suppose. We're locking the promotion and she wants to get her creative skill, which is good anyway, because she thinks she's an arts and crafts hobby sim. Maybe that's not her one true hobby. No, it's not. But she did art at university, so she obviously likes it. Right, Dirk, let's get these this money before school. And maybe we will... I guess he'll just continue playing his game. I don't know how they do the competitions. I really keep forgetting to Google it. <laughs> Darren, I'm going to let him paint until he's basically finished his picture. Uh, Darlene's going to work now. Dirk's going to school. See you later, guys. Oh, we need to change Dylan's diaper. And probably about the time we fed him as well. He's a stinkums. He wants to get a job. Darren, I mean, don't know. You wanted to quit your last job. I don't know about this, Darren. Let's see what jobs are available. But I just don't think... I think you should be a stay-at-home artist and look after your kid. Nah, he's not going to want to do any of these jobs. Oceanography, entertainment, show business, athletic and military. No. You can make money. You can do it. I believe in you. We need to get him to pay the bills as well. Oh, did our maid not come because we didn't pay her? I don't know if they quit when that happens. Oh, he finished his painting. Well done. Make like £500 a painting. Probably more than he's earning from work. Let's see what will happen. Okay, she's going to come back. <laughs> we need you to come back. Let's see if Dirk is doing a bit better in school. I hope so. Um, Yeah, he's gone up to a C plus, so we do need to do all the homework. Okay. That's okay. That's fine. It is Thursday, so we will flip his coin. At least I know now. Because otherwise it's just pointless them doing some, isn't it? Right, let's flip the coin again. Look, it's still open on my phone. And he got tails. So unfortunately not doing his homework. <laughs> oh, Dirk, you tried. And then it all just went a bit wrong for you. Oh my God, Dirk was just making a booty call and his mum's just come home from work. Uh ow. Ah, oh, she wants to gain a generic skill point. Perfect. Let's have her gain... Mechanical. I know you're excited about going back to work, but uh, he's doing a booty call. Oh my gosh. D Darren is busy painting and Dirk is having a booty call with his girlfriend. Oh my gosh. <laughs> I love it. Oh, and Darling got her mechanical point. That was quick. Awesome. Good job. Let's take a shower. She wants to get mechanical level three. I'll keep that locked in because she probably will need that for work. But she's probably going to get promoted to level four, which will be really good. Darren's still painting and the teenagers are going to sneak upstairs while everybody's busy and just pop into mum and dad's room. <laughs> oh, wow. So they're busy. 
um, we'll just watch Darren. <laughs> oh my god, Dylan's birthday's going to be the next round. That's so exciting. Um, so the next round will be Friday, Saturday, Sunday, and Dirk will be, oh, he will be like aging up to go to college. Uh, Darlene, maybe don't go in your bedroom just yet. Why don't you come and, why don't you do some painting next to you? Carry on with your little picture. What are you doing? You're sweet talking. <laughs> okay. Uh, Dirk is holding hands with Lilith. At least they finished. These two are a cute couple. Really cute. I might, um, after this episode, look into some other people's methods for homework because this just doesn't seem to be working how I want it to be. It's very... I don't know. I've seen people base it on the teen's attitude towards work, so I might develop a new system instead of once based with coin flips because it just doesn't work right we need to go oh he's going on his driving lesson now okay do you have work oh you do you should just get back in time for work then if you're gonna hang around or oh let's come and look after the baby she's about to get a skill point there we go let's go and get our skill point be saved from death darlene you already got saved from death once sweet i know it was probably very exciting i'm hoping Dirk's gonna be okay for work i think he might have missed his carpool because it probably came at I think he missed work because his carpool comes an hour early, right? Oh, no. Can he walk to work now? Are you way too late? Uh, he can walk to work. Cool. Let's go. Let's go. You're really late. <laughs> okay, Darlene's gone to bed and Darren's going to eat. I wonder if they're going to have another baby one after Dylan ages up. Right, Dirk's home from work, so at least he wasn't too late. And I'm going to get him sent off to bed. And then I will join you guys in the next episode, which I think will be pleasant, probably. I think so. I'm not 100% sure. I can never remember. But we'll rejoin the Dreamers next time and we'll be seeing if Dirk can keep his grades up and go to college. That'll be interesting to see. And yeah, while I'm off screen, I'm going to devise a new system for the homework and we'll take it from there. Thank you so much for watching and I hope you enjoyed it. Don't forget to like, comment and subscribe and I'll see you in the next one. Bye guys.